The world's most famous geyser, Old Faithful in Yellowstone is located in Yellowstone's upper geyser basin in the southwest section of the park. Yellowstone is a vast caldera, a depression formed by the eruption of volcanic magma, 15,000 years ago. This very location was covered with a thick ice cap. Geologic studies indicate that Yellowstone's large geysers formed after glaciers receded from the Yellowstone caldera about 15,000 years ago and that it takes thousands of years to construct the large geyser cones. Old Faithful erupts on an average interval of 90 minutes, varying from 50 to 127 minutes. An eruption lasts 1.5 to 5 minutes and expels 3,700 to 8,400 gallons of boiling water and reaches a height of 106 to 184 feet. The steam temperature can be above 350 degrees Fahrenheit. The Yellowstone geysers have become dry in the past depending on the amount of rainfall. This might happen again if global warming continues and the area experiences drought. Yellowstone brings in upwards of 4 million visitors a year. Securing a great view of the geyser's cone can be a challenge. The geyser viewing area has large bench seating, a parking lot and a beautiful visitor center. It is best to come early for a seating near the front. For a more intimate experience, avoid from noon until 6 p.m. Another option is to watch from the boardwalk. If you visit the park in the winter, there will not be a huge crowd. Native Americans were hunting and gathering here for at least 11,000 years. The peak of Native American activity in Yellowstone was between 3,000 to 1,500 years ago, but even in the 19th century it was still heavily used, with as many as 10 tribes living around the lake, including Crow, Blackfeet, Flathead, Shoshone, Nez Perce, and Bannock. They were pushed out by the government after the park was established. The army was brought in to keep them out. And the public was told that Native Americans were never here in the first place because they were afraid of the geysers. The natives regarded Yellowstone as having spiritual significance. They believed it was full of spirits that were friendly and helpful. Native American names for Yellowstone referred to its thermal properties, such as many smoke or place of hot water. In general, Yellowstone's geysers, mud pots, hot springs and fumaroles were regarded as places of great spiritual power. Maybe, if we sit here for a while and watch quietly, we might relive their experience.